So. Uh. And we're good. Um, hey, this is uh, D Master Kilo 15. And, and uh, HMA Channel 13 to 5. The man that created the channel in the first place. Uh, right now, we are going to be um, giving you a little bit of a strategy guide and a few tips and tricks about how to work uh, the um, Black Ops Zombies. And, um, it doesn't matter which map you know you play on. It could be any, any sort of map. Actually, shoot the map here. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> it could be any sort of map. Ah, uh, we'll shoot. Now, for, we're doing King or Dead Totem here. It doesn't matter, as I said before, it doesn't matter which map. Uh, it could be on um, the new one, Ascension, or anything. Uh, hit it, dude. Get this started here. Now, what we're going to be um, showing you is something that we, me and my friends like to call the, uh, the loop method. Now, what we do here is that... Um, well, obviously, if you stop moving, you know the zombies are going to be coming towards you. So you got to then you will be fucked. So you got to keep on moving. So a friend, a couple friends, and I, we developed the um, something called the loop method, and we first did it here in Kino. And um, I'm going to be spacing out now. All right, hold on. You take, you take, um, you take the front two windows. I'll take the I'll take one off the top there. Anyway, so. Yeah, we developed this plan, <clears throat> and uh, look, we actually found it to be pretty effective because uh, one, the zombies can never catch up to you, and two, you can you can just fire at them on the go. Now, you might, of course, you're gonna figure, you're gonna try and uh, figure out like where where you would want to start the loop method. The good and key are to them what we usually. My usual loops, looping spot. No, I want to My usual looping spot is um. Well, we like to open up some of the doors first, and then we go around to the stage. And once around starts, I start. I go from the stage all the way around, and then back around to the stage again. Just so that they don't catch us. Exactly. But but then there's another thing. If you have two people doing this, which me and Nick are doing this, then there's actually two loop, loop, uh, looping methods because uh, two, two people on one loop won't work. Trust me, we tried that a couple matches ago when I got raped. And um, so one person per loop, but the second the second looping uh, looping spot around Kino you know, is around the stage actually. Like you run circles around the stage while the other person runs out and through the um, the actual theater. Oh, I'm like, yeah, I'm like, I'm so, yeah, anyway. So yeah, there's the looping method. And um uh once we get going here we'll show you uh you know how this will work. So before anything, unfortunately I do not normally have black ops, so I wouldn't have played it on the uh master. <laughs> Alright, so uh I'm just gonna start this up later on, hold on. That's warming up. Okay, this uh, we're here at the stage area. I'm on top. Um, Nick's on the bottom. So what we're doing here? Uh, There's jokes to be made about that. Yeah, shut up. <laughs> All right. So we get we left one zombie alive, and we already turned on the power in uh, ba uh, backstage right there. You can see on Nick's screen. Um, by the way, sorry for the crappy ass quality, but I, w I will get a capture card sometime soon. But yeah, so we left one zombie alive, and Nick knows his loop. He's looping around the stage as I loop around the whole map. Uh, we gotta Don't kill. Let me run. All right, so we gotta kill the last zombie whenever it gets here. Actually, I'll just go up and kill it. So we gotta kill the last zombie. Then we're gonna show you how this works. Where the hell is this bitch? That's a good question. Where the hell went? Uh, what happened to that zombie? Even? There he is. No, the, that's the sound of the crawlers breaking through. Because oh, uh, we just activated that power. That is a beautiful noise. Get back to the stage, dude. Okay. We don't want, we don't want to risk it. What the hell is he? Good job, Nick. That's my bad. Hey, <laughs> you're the one that's not... Shut up. <laughs> what the hell is he? Um, I think that might just be the answer. Hell. 
I'm looking around here. I'm not finding him. Oh, here he is. Finally. All right. Go. All right. It took so many shots to get a headshot. Okay, so here we go. We're about to start this. Um, now, Nick, you're going to have to be careful. I know. I'll go out and... Oh, yeah, one thing. Always activate the teleporter whenever you can. I'll, I'll activate the other pad when I'm out there. All right, so it's only around 5, but we're going to start the loop here. All right, I'm going. Nick, you keep moving. Pull up, pull out your... Holy shit. Pull out your RPK. Fuck, we need Juggernaug, too. Alright, we just remember one thing, you always gotta get Dragonog in. Sometimes when you're outside when ah. you're doing the other loop outside of the stage, sometimes you can loop around the lobby too, but only sometimes. You see like how I how I'm doing it here. Alright, Nuke. Thank you. Wait. No, not thank you. Anyway. Ow. Yeah, Nick just got hit by a crawler. Anyway, so you're so smart. But yeah, this tends to work up until like, like, for us, usually it seems to be like around, like, like maybe the late 20s and 30s. Now do not, do not do what I'm doing up top here. Do not stop. Like, try, if you have, if you want to stop, just to like, take a break, that's fine, but you gotta keep moving. Especially... Or else we will find you. But if you if you want to stop, make sure you have like uh like one of the machine guns like I do, like the RPK or the H and K. For some reason, Nick and I both have RPKs. Damn mystery box. Yeah, mystery box. Now I'm looking around here. Uh, Nick, I'm getting close to you. You might want to start your your walk. Actually, no. I think this is the last guy. Fit is. I'm going to be like. Mad. Wait, stop! 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 I want to see if it's... No, he's not the last. Okay. Damn. But yeah, um, this method tends to work a lot, actually. It's actually pretty good. Um, Nick, we're going to need to save it to buy, uh, to buy the to Juggernaug. Oh, the Juggernaug. That was way off. Okay. Oh, <sighs> Okay, so we're basically just going to uh, skip ahead and make a conclusion about the whole looping method. Because I died and brought us down. Yeah, because he tried to go for the mystery box while the whole round was still going on. Dumbass got himself killed. Hi. And got me killed. <laughs> because like, as I tried to save his ass, all the zombies that he had from his loop came to me and mauled my ass. My last words were, if you can revive me, you are now my new god. And that did not happen, because I somehow got jumped. Because and we were saving for Juggernaug! <laughs> we didn't even have enough money for Juggernaug! Speaking <laughs> <laughs> on, Satan! <laughs> anyway, the looping method, if you do it right, and you're good at it, <laughs> if you do it right, it will actually take you pretty far into the, um, the round. And, um, one thing about dog rounds, usually if you stay around the stage area, that actually tends to be a good spot to fight dogs. Um, uh, I think you wanted to give a shout out? Right, um, I want to give a shout out to my girlfriend, her YouTube channel, Day 11 9 Um, she has two funny videos. Uh, her, her channel will be up top here, like I did with the next channel. Um, alright folks, I guess that's it for the looping method, uh, you know, we're pretty masterful, thank you.